morning guys and welcome back to day four um, of this week's uh, home workout series. Uh, today we'll be looking at arms, uh, so it'll be a multiple of, um, of buys and tries. Um, this, this, this is going to be purely uh, resistance band related, there'll be no dumbbells uh, in this workout today. I know that obviously some of you don't have access uh, to dumbbells, so I thought for this one I'll actually just purely do resistance bands. So we'll be doing a close, close to it, close grip curl. So we'll be doing some standard bicep curls, but I should be actually be using uh, a handle from a broom to sort of make it more like a barbell. Um, we'll turn at hammer curls. We'll be looking at behind head curls as well, which is uh, a move that some of you might not be aware of. Um, bent over tri extensions, some normal tri push downs, and I will finish off with some reverse. Um, push downs as well, or pull downs, should I say? Um, yeah. So if, if one other thing, if any of you are interested in in having these these workouts I've put together this week, uh, email to you. Um, then I'm, I'm happy to do that. So please drop a comment um, below, and I shall uh, get some sent over to you. So right. Anyway, let's get on with uh, today's workouts. Uh, the important thing um, this one guys is to um, basically just sort of start with your um, your uh, resistance bands down by your side um, and then sort of gradually curl them up right close into the middle and hold it again for a second or so and then a slow movement back down again um, this actual close grip um, maneuver is um, one of the best actually for, for building up the peak of the bicep um, so uh, yeah, it's definitely worth incorporating into your voice step workouts. Um, so yeah, give it a go.
So I actually finished um, the uh, barbell, so barbell curls there with um, with a set wide wide grip um, curls instead, just to hit the inner inner part of the bicep um, instead of just sort of keeping it all relatively neutral. Um, it's nice to incorporate a wide a mixture really of wide, obviously narrow, and also your close grip as well. So. She did a static hold um, between each one, so as you saw there, sort of, you know, so it gives you a chance to keep constant pressure on um, on one arm at a time. Um, so that's another good method you can incorporate into um, into doing like the hammer hammer style curls. Is to just do static holds, but not every week. I wouldn't recommend you do that sort of thing every week. I tend to like throw that sort of exercise in every two or three weeks.
that, um, that reverse pull down guys is really ideal to end your, um, your tri, uh, tricep um, workouts because it really does burn them out. You don't need a very heavy weight either, just something reasonably light that you can sort of get a good, you know, just a good burn of a, sort of a faster reps just to sort of burn those triceps out. Well guys, that's the end of today's uh, arm session. Um, it's actually surprising uh, how good a session you can get from just using resistance bands. Um, you know, I purely want to do this this um, this video based on resistance bands, but obviously feel free to change up if you have access to dumbbells. Feel free to change up between the resistance bands and the dumbbells if if you want to. Um, so yeah, so that brings the end to uh, the fourth day in this uh, week long home workout session. I um, hope you've enjoyed it and uh, again you get something from this, it's, you know I'm putting these together purely just to, just to assist you with um, you know your workouts at home, showing you what I'm, what I'm sort of currently doing as well. Um, so yeah the next session, um, tomorrow will be pure back, back session so um, hope you join me for that. Um, as always like, subscribe, any comments please direct them to look below to me and I will do my best to get back to you guys. Um, Take care, stay safe, and I'll see you soon.